Welcome to our review on electrical appliances. So hopefully we remember that the electrical appliance is something we use to carry out a particular job for us. And what happens is that the electrical appliance transfers energy when a charge flows through them. Now some of that energy will be transferred to useful energy stores, but anything that doesn't go to the useful energy store is wasted. Just to give you an idea about what we're meaning by this useful and wasted energy, I've given you three examples of appliances in the table. So the light bulb, first of all, its useful energy will be the light that's emitted by the glowing filament, but the wasted energy is any that's being transferred to heat the surroundings. If we think about the electric heater, its whole purpose is to heat the surroundings, so that energy is the useful, but if the bars are glowing in order to do that, that light is wasted energy. In terms of the electric motor, then kinetic energy of the object is useful and the gravitational potential energy of the object being lifted by the motor is useful. But any energy that's transferred to heating the object or to have any sound, that is wasted energy. So when it comes to actually trying to decide what appliance to either purchase or use for a particular job, there's a few things you need to consider before making your decision. So the first one is quite an obvious one. What is the function of that particular appliance? So what job do you want to carry out? Will the appliance do this? Second is, are there any restrictions on the kind of appliance that be suitable? So if we're looking at a very remote region away from any kind of civilization, saying something that's going to be powered by the electrical mains isn't a good choice because you won't have access to that. And finally, the efficiency of the appliance. You want to select an appliance that is as efficient as possible to minimize the amount of energy being wasted. Hopefully at the end of this video, you can now talk about electrical appliances and how they have useful and wasted energy, being able to look at any given example and identify what they would be, and that you can also consider what kind of appliance you should be using based on properties that they give you in a question.